cup of joe. About four or five cups of coffee a day. That's generally how much caffeine the U.S. Food and Drug Administration says is safe for a healthy adult. However, some are more sensitive to caffeine in coffee than others. So let's talk about it. So how does the drug affect your body? That is tonight's good question. We asked dietitian Ju Julia Zampano. She says that the drug works by blocking adenosine receptors in your brain. Those receptors slow down nerve activity, which make us feel tired. That helps explain the afternoon crash some of us may feel when the effects of that morning coffee begins to wear off. It's important to understand your threshold, how you react to caffeine, how much you're having, how you're dosing it throughout the day. Now, for most people, moderate caffeine consumption can be part of a healthy diet. See this word here, though, moderation. Too much can lead to side effects. We're talking about things like insomnia, jitters, anxiousness, fast heart rate, upset stomach, nausea, and headache. Also, that feeling of unhappiness can also creep in. So, Zampano says it's important to pay attention to the source of your caffeine. If it's in a sugary beverage or coffee drink that's containing a tremendous amount of sugar or calories or fat, we're really not gaining the benefit. Well, since caffeine affects everyone differently, Zampano says to measure how much you can handle without having any negative side effects. I usually say start low, start small, and then add very gradually. So keep that all in mind. Thanks for watching tonight. We appreciate it. WBTV News.